Spurs and Thunder in Oklahoma City. Before the game, Oklahoma hero Wayman Teasdale uh, received a Community Hero Award from the Oklahoma City Thunder. Congratulations to Mr. Tisdale. Then uh, it's Greg Popovich. Also, uh, before the game, looking to get his Spurs their 50th win for the 10th straight season, minus Manu Ginobili, of course. But when you got Tony Parker, that makes things a lot easier. Parker with the lay-in, then he's feeding Tim Duncan off the pick and roll. He hits Jay Cap an 8-0 run. Later, Thunder get hot. Jeff Green for three. 16 points for him. Nice ball movement here. Then it's Tavo Cephalosha. Three up, three down. Thunder five for six three-pointers in the first quarter. Cephalosha 13 points. Second quarter now, Thunder on the run. Kevin Durant off the feed. He be jamming. 48-44, Thunder in control. Meanwhile, they struggle to score a little bit later. Tony Parker, run the court, gets it to go with the foul. 21 points, 10 assists for him. Spurs up by one at the break. In the third, Roger Mason. He's in the starting lineup for uh, Ginobili, playing pretty well. Hits the 313 points. Meanwhile, it's Tony Parker frees the D. Looks like he's going to shoot instead. He feeds Tim Duncan. Who scores the lay in? Three point game. Spurs on top. Then it's Kevin Durant keeping the Thunder in it. A little defense and the jam on the other end. Thunder scored on the first six possessions of the second half. More Durant running the court again. He's long, lays it in with the left here. OKC right in the ball game. He had 24 points. Fourth quarter now, five point game. Spurs on top. DJ White. Coming off a 7-for-8 performance in his first career game. Played well again. Six points in this game. Speaking of playing well, Tim Duncan had himself a ball game. 25 points, 15 rebounds. Also passed David Robinson for first in Spurs franchise history in rebounds. Drew Gooden had a good game. 20 points off the bench for him. Spurs get the win by 10. Their 50th win this year for the 10th straight season. That matches the second longest streak for any franchise in NBA history.